Hey everyone, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to install IMG files into Basecamp. But before we get started, let's talk about why you might want to do this. IMG files are typically map files that are used with GPS devices. They can be a great way to get custom maps or maps for areas that aren't included in the default Basecamp maps. So, how do you install IMG files into Basecamp? Well, there are a few different ways, but I'm going to show you the easiest method. Step 1. Download the IMG file you want to install. You can usually find IMG files on the website of the company that created them. For example, if you're looking for custom maps for your Garmin GPS device, you can find them on the Garmin website. Step 2. Extract the IMG file. Once you've downloaded the IMG file, you'll need to extract it. This can usually be done by right-clicking on the file and selecting Extract All. Step 3. Copy the IMG file to the Basecamp folder. The Basecamp folder is typically located in the following location on your computer. Windows. C colon backslash program files. X86. Backslash Garmin backslash Basecamp. Mac slash applications slash Basecamp dot app slash contents. Resources. Once you've located the Basecamp folder, simply copy the IMG file into it. Step 4. Launch Basecamp. If Basecamp is already open, you'll need to close it and then launch it again. Step 5. Select the Maps tab. Once you've launched Basecamp, select the Maps tab. Step 6. Click on the Add Map button. The Add Map button is located in the upper left corner of the Basecamp window. Step 7. Select the IMG file you want to install. In the Add Map dialog box, select the IMG file you want to install. Step 8. Click on the Opened button. Once you've selected the IMG file, click on the Open button. Step 9. The IMG file will be installed into Basecamp. Once the IMG file has been installed, you'll be able to see it in the Maps tab of Basecamp. That's it. You've successfully installed an IMG file into Basecamp. I hope this tutorial has been helpful. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. And if you're looking for more tips and tricks on how to use Basecamp, be sure to check out my other videos. Thanks for watching.